I think that The Sims 4 is way, way too easy, and I think that's something a lot of players feel. Being the sadist that I am, I really need to feel that Sims out there are suffering. They live in a stupid little perfect fantasy world where you can meet someone and get married in the same day. It's a life simulation. Not everyone is rich and some of us have to budget aggressively to pay the bills. As of today, I'm officially launching a mod that will increase the difficulty in a few areas that will have a broad impact. First, I want this struggle to be very real early in a game. Money making is far too easy and everything you buy is far too cheap for the amount of income you're bringing in. For that reason, my mod will half every source of income in the game. This serves the purpose of making you have to think a little more about what to buy because it effectively doubles the prices of all items and things like meals that are in the game. This may even encourage you to bother to cook with fresh produce. I don't want to go through every source of income, so it literally ties into the code that gives your Sims money and cuts it in half. So this even impacts cheats. Uh, probably not money X though. Next, bills. You would think having incomes would be enough, but I want to budget a bit. The bills are a bit of a joke due to the huge cash flows. They're doubled, so poor sims will be poor, and rich sims will need to maintain their lifestyle. This, combined with the fact that incomes are halved, will mean that you'll need to take some risks to get a skill like painting to be profitable. It won't be for a few levels, because the base price is still the same, but you're getting half of your money back. Why should a level 1 artist break even on each and every painting anyway. Emotion is another thing. While I can't make each and every social fail more, I sure can tap into your sim's puny brain and make them dwell on things a lot more. All moodlets that are negative hit twice as hard, and at the same time, those the game deems are big events have their durations extended dramatically. So you will be sad almost a week on the death of a loved one if you don't do something to help your sim process those emotions. Little moments like a bladder failure may prove fatal. Because the moodlet will hit at plus 10 intensity, I actually expect that some players will keep some satisfaction points on hand to be able to drink a quick happy potion to save their life giving those items a purpose. You can also try to run for a bed to sleep it off. In the base game, a system exists that lets you whittle down negative emotions, such as by talking to yourself in a mirror, talking to other sims, or doing activities like jogging or using the punching bag to clear your sim's head. You might actually need to use these things for once. You can still cover it up with a good mood, but it'll take a bit more effort to do this. Since this impacts every sim in the game, you will need to woo people out of a bad mood to have a good chance of socializing and befriending them. Yes, you can still exploit crap like the camera, but I'll be looking into disabling that on one of the early updates. Taking a picture shouldn't increase friendship at all, let alone five in a row. Eventually, I'll get into more specific things, but for now, I want people's opinions on what it's like to play this way. Are these changes too aggressive? Could we use a second version with harder multipliers? I might allow the player to customize some of these settings in the future. I don't want to talk this mod up too much. It needs work and a lot more thought and feedback. It is not a magic bullet because the game's far too simple for changes like this to be enough to fix the difficulty. But an attempt was made. <laughs> uh, I will update it from time to time with new ideas, and if it goes a bit too far off the rails, I'll spin my ideas into other mods. I've been developing a Blender add-on for about four months, and I'm glad to finally take what I learned in Python and put it to good use in The Sims 4. You can download it at the link in the description or in the pinned comment. I won't be holding this back for patrons only because I think it'd be wrong if you support me to get it and end up hating it. 
But hey, if you like it, toss me a buck or five. I'm still one of those people who budgets, so it's handy. Thanks for watching and throw me some ideas in the comments. I'll read like all of them. <laughs>